was brought to you by Earth. On YouTube, enhance and mobile advertising on Facebook. I'm going to dig all this out at the end of that trench, bring it down to here, and then this is going to be the tomato beds, and we'll work on that too. All right, it's May the 26th, Zone 6 in Southern Illinois, and this is the tomato uh, garden or grow bed that I set up for the tomatoes and I finally got the dirt from over here transferred to over here and filled in I put plastic over it and I'll start planting tomatoes in there got the, the chicken wire underneath there and I got I'm going to do an elevated garden up here next. So, let me get a picture of it. A couple of pictures. This is the mess that I got out of there. I'll start uh, making a video of all the garbage and stuff that I pulled out of the dirt. Keep tabs on that. Okay, I started on my first tomato patch. And like I showed you with the plastic, I've got that down. It sticks in the mark where I'm going to have the seeds. I open up some holes. And we're going to grow nine of them three of them up against the edge there. I'm putting up sticks around it, tying them off to where when the tomato plant gets bigger, it won't fall over. I have another one running down the center and one ending right here, and that's after I put the seeds down. So get a picture of it. And this is uh, May the 30th, Zone 6 in Southern Illinois. Okay, it's May the 30th, 2019, and this is uh, Zone 6 in Southern Illinois. And I finally finished with those tomato plants. Put uh, three in each uh, hole, and they're ready to grow. Went ahead and set up the stick in the middle and tie it off. It's not the best, but I'm hoping that it won't have to um, hold up too much to weight for the tomato plants. Hopefully, they don't break down in the storm, but cut it off. Connected there. And there. And there. It's not beautiful, you know, but pretty, I should say, but maybe it'll work. So, if not, I can improve it. Okay, the, I added some stuff on the uh, tomato uh, garden right here. I put the stick in the middle to elevate this one up because it's sagging down. And this is what it looks like. Okay, June 10th, 2019, we're finally getting tomato plants. These two aren't doing anything, but we're getting some there, there, over there, 
there, there, and we're getting all of them in the corners. Okay, as I was saying before, got tomato seeds there on the side, two of them there, and one, or one coming out right in there. So, I try to get closer up, but I've got a limited space here. It's June the 16th, 2019 in Southern Illinois, Zone 6. These are This is an update on my tomato plants. So far, so good. Those I've carved them. There's the plant right there. Two. Now these two didn't grow. I'm going to have to reseed those. But so far, so good. This came off over there, and I had to put this back up, and I think this one came off too. Okay, this is in April or June the 26, 2019. Here's an update. My tomato plants. They're coming along, the ones that are growing are coming along. And that is the plant right there for that one. And you have that one over there, right there. And that one there. This one right here. And this one too. So I'll keep regular posts on. July the 19th, 2019, uh, in Southern Illinois, Zone 6. This is an update on the uh, tomato plants that I'm growing. Got one that fell over right here. This fell down. And that one just fell over, but I can probably set that up to where it's straight. But here is what they look like so far. Okay, it's July the 14th, 2019, and this is an update on my tomato plants. I've got, got them growing so good so far, I had to put a stake there to hold those two up because they fell over. But so far so good. was brought to you by Earth on YouTube and Hanson Mobile Advertising on Facebook. We thank you for your participation. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe, share, make comments. We love feedback.